Hello Zebra Herd, welcome back to Planet vs. Zombies Battle for Neighborville. Today we're actually going online and getting into some online action. I was going to do this last episode, but I wanted to give a little bit more time to the story mode. But I think from here on out, we're gonna be balancing our acts between each episode, sometimes going online, showcasing classes, and other times going to the story mode and making some more progress there. So if you didn't see last episode, we played as the brand new class Snapdragon as we made our entry into the town center and beat up Baron Von. On bats. That was a lot of fun. But now we're gonna be doing the multiplayer portal. There's only one game mode available right now in the Founders Pack Week 1, which is Turf Takeover. Compete in 24 player PvP battle for control over an expanding map. Attacking team needs to reach their objective while the defending team needs to hold the line. We of course had this in Garden War for 1 and 2, but I'm glad to see it return. We're gonna be playing as pea shooter, so let's go ahead and get started. Oh. That didn't work. <laughs> Wait, what? Did I not select it properly? That might have been the problem. Uh, multiplayer portal. There we go. All right, we're ready to go. Let's play online. Oh, so it looks like we're in a map called the Peachy District. And oh man, this looks so much like a Garden War for One map. I love that. Garden War for One had the great map design. But we're going to be playing mostly as Pea Shooter today. That's the class I wanted to showcase. We'll be showcasing each of the classes in this game throughout the series, so stay tuned for that. But we've already gotten Pea Shooter to level eight throughout the last couple of episodes. As you can see, he's level eight right now. He needs 656 experience to get to the next level. So yeah, that'll be fun. We already have some upgrades on him. I don't really have too much more to do here, but he has three abilities. He has his hyper, which will make him jump really high. Is nobody here? Oh no, I'm all on my own. Well, that's not good, which is weird because there's like a lot of friends available. So maybe I'll have to reset this up, but I was gonna talk about his abilities. I guess I'll do that once we actually get into a game. Okay, this time it worked. It looks like we're just sort of in a random spot in the map. I'm sorry for that, but the pea shooter has three abilities. He has his hyper run ability, which, okay. Well, it doesn't make him run any faster, but it will make him jump super high, which could be very good for getting advantage so that we can use his other abilities. Like the triangle is going to be the Gatling. We can zoom in and do some extra damage from really far away. It's really focused in as well. And then we also have his chili bean bomb, which will make some zombies go near it, at least the AI zombies, the computer zombies, and then it'll explode, do a bunch of damage. And now that I've wasted all those abilities, let's actually go into the fight. <laughs> oh, let's get this guy a little bit. Can I get my first vanquish in the game? Come on! Oh, it was, it was at least an assist. All right, well, that, that just shows you probably the, the pace I'm gonna be going at in this series. Oh gosh, here's another 80s action hero zombie. What are you doing, dude? Oh no, this is actually really problematic, but I might be able to throw a chili bean bomb down so that he can get hit by it. I don't know if that worked. Uh, okay, come on, I almost got him. He's trying to run away. Don't you dare. I got him! Our first vanquish, that was awesome! I can't believe it. Oh man, so this is a turf takeover. Ow, ow, ow. The goal is not to get beat up by a soldier, but instead to survive and get on the point so that we can keep pushing the map forward. Oh man, that looks classic. That is super cool. I'm so excited. Okay, let's respawn now. And let's get back into it. So over this way, past the passing gas. So it looks like the zombie spawn is just right over there. But man, this is so cool. Of course, there's a lot of action in this game already, and this is only the uh, smaller, fragmented version of it, the uh, Founders Edition. So there's gonna be more content as the weeks go on, which means more episodes and more things to do in the episodes. But this is the uh, garden we're trying to, or I guess a graveyard, whatever. We're just trying to claim this point. Try to claim this turf, our chili bean bombs in there. All right, well, that it was an assist. That's pretty good. Uh, what can we do over here? There's an acorn. Oh man, I cannot wait to check out those new classes. We'll be doing that soon. Oh, let's go for you as soon as I can. Man, he runs quick. Buddy's done, he's finished. Okay, so we're good, we're good. I'm gonna make my way in, cause, oh wait, no, there's another zombie going in over that way. A lot of 80s action hero players right now. Oh, that's speaking of which, there's one right there. Beat him up, beat him up. Awesome, level nine achieved. We're going through this quick. And I kept on calling this guy Torchwood. He's not Torchwood, he's Oak. He's a new character. Oh gosh, come on, get him. Where do you think you're going, sir? Foot soldiers over this way. I'm trying to catch up with him. He's a little too quick. Uh, get back here. That's it. Come on. Chili bean bomb. That's sort of good. Oh no, he jumped over it. Oh, that didn't really get anybody. How did they all get here so quick? Got him. He doesn't see me, so I'm going for him as much as I can. Oh, can we get another one? Can we get another one? Almost. Oh, uh, okay, come on, I'm still alive. <laughs> no, I'm not. That was crazy. I got them really low at the least. It looks like the uh, nightcaps sprung in there. 
Got me with the boogie bolt, yikes. So you can see that they're a recruit. I don't exactly know what that means. Maybe like once we reach a certain level, we can upgrade people. But as you can see, we have seven vanquishes already. We're doing pretty good. I would hope to get top vanquisher. That would be awesome. But to do that, we're gonna have to keep working and keep earning more vanquishes today as the pea shooter. But yeah, pea shooter seems to be very similar, almost exactly to how he was in Garden War for one and two. Now, I haven't seen the ability to change our abilities. I can hold the left analog stick, by the way, to run a little faster. I need to keep doing that, I keep forgetting. Um, but you can just click that down and you run extra fast. Um, yeah, you can't attack or, or anything when you're doing that. But of course, originally in Garden War for two and one, you could change out abilities for certain other ones. Doesn't seem like you can do that as much here, which is a shame. So we're still trying to, okay, we're defending this. We're not trying to capture it. Okay, that's why I was getting a little confused. I was like, I feel like we've been on this a lot, but we're, we are defending really well if that's the case. But yeah, um, in Guard of War for one and two, you could change Pea Shooter's Hyper to instead being a super jump to be a super speed. I don't think that's the case anymore. I think it's only super jump, which is a bit of a shame. Oh, there's a little Yeti in. Can the zombies still spawn those in? I guess so, ow. Oh, gotcha, gotcha, I think there was a space cadet. Oh, I see you up there. Oh, I'm done for. <laughs> They're taking me out from every angle. That was crazy, but it looks like this round is about to end and all these zombies can get on the point and push it into what's probably gonna be overtime. Uh, it's contested, yeah, they are trying to take it back. But as you can see, I don't think they've captured any of it yet. So they aren't doing too good of a job. We'll keep going, we'll try to get in there. Overtime, uh-oh. This is problematic. Come on, let's get in there and fight some zombies. We have to get them all off the point. Don't know how well that's gonna go. I don't wanna get caught by the zombies too soon though. I do see a, a disco zombie coming in that way. Um, Yeah, I'm gonna do this. Get into the Gatling mode and start beating some guys up if I can. Wait, what happened? I don't know. I do not, not, not know what the oak did there. That was crazy. Oh man, you have a lot of extra defense actually. I need to be careful of that. Come on, I need to actually get onto the point. It looks like there's a disco zombie. I got the vanquish on you. Soup for the soul, apparently. Don't know what that's for. Okay. More zombies over this way. My chili bean's already back up. He's gonna go into their little... Oh, will that actually get in, buddy? It will. Awesome. Where are you? Here's an imp. Down with the imp. Max level reach. So level 10 is max level. That's awesome. So we're gonna be able to promote the pea shooter at the end of today's episode. That's cool. Come on, overtime's almost over. There it is, we get our first victory in the game. Hopefully we can start a new round totally fresh. That would be awesome. But there we go, the tip topiary. <laughs> I like that. Um, I think it's supposed to be showing us something. There we go. Um, so we were able to defend all four points that time. Your team wins, we defended the park. So only four points instead of like six or seven you would find in Garden War for one and two. That's interesting, I wonder if the maps will be smaller. But look at this, we got Top Vanquisher, my first game online. Let's see the happy jump. Happy jump. That's cool. I can't believe it. I'm so happy that we got a, a, a top performer in our first round online. Isn't that super cool? We also get ourselves um, a good chunk of coins, 5,000. At the end of today's episode, I plan on spending some of my coins, not all of them, so if you're interested in seeing what that's like, stay tuned to the end of the episode. Hopefully I don't forget. <laughs> Be able to take a look at the scoreboard as well, and never mind, we're moving on. So let's go to the next round and see how things go. Maybe it'll be on the same map, maybe it'll be somewhere else. We'll have to wait and see. Whoa, okay, we're already, that loaded super quick. Turning point, turf takeover. Usually it takes like a minute and a half to go to the next, you know, turf takeover. I would really like to continue playing plants. Oh no, come on, please. Please, I need to play as pea shooter. Oh no. <laughs> I might just like wait here and see if any, room opens up, because today's goal is to showcase the future. But you know, in the meantime, I'll play a little bit of uh, All-Star, and we'll see how that, not All-Star, Soldier, what am I talking about? The game begins in 25 seconds, so it hasn't even started yet, which is why I'd really like to change teams. Looks like I'm not having the option just yet, but I will keep checking, because that's the goal of today's episode. This is a cool looking map so far. I really hope there's a giant sunflower in one of these maps, the Guard Over One style, that's my favorite one. This is really cool. So it seems like this game does have a combination of music from the other Garden Warfare games. Defend the payload. Okay. So we're just supposed to defend this point. Guard the bomb of granite. Safeguard my brain's finder satellite launch. Go. 
What is that? Okay, that sentence is a little bit of gibberish. Oh gosh, we already got this guy right here. Get him. He is so quick. My gosh. Okay, this thing to be like his super move. Keep firing at him. And he's gone. Oh, when he's in that sphere, I think he's invisible. That's scary. Okay, this guy's good. Gotta be careful. I missed. Well, it did do some good explosion damage. There's the bank, which I'm gonna hop up this way. Uh, lots of plants, mostly all nightcaps. Whoa, got some weeds coming in. So it looks like they might have a payload they need to push, which would be amazing. I love payload game modes in games like this, but they didn't have too many in the original Garden Warfare. So that is a giant log. There's a Snapdragon. Oh no, oh no, he's got me in his zone. That's not good. Back it up, back it up. I can't even tell what's happening right now. There's like so much action. Maybe now we can change teams though. <laughs> It's supposed to be a pea shooter showcase, so let's keep talking about pea shooter. Pea shooter's a lot of fun in this one, just like he was in the original. Uh, unable to switch teams, other team is full. That really is a shame. Um, I will keep checking for that every time I get the chance, because it looks like we actually have an extra slot in our team. Man, if somebody could, uh, actually maybe not. It's hard to tell. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. So no, we actually have an extra slot. If somebody could do me a solid and switch over. That'd be great. So it looks like they're two thirds. Yep, right about now, captured with this. So they almost have it. Oh yeah, let me do my super run. <laughs> Look at this. Oh, that's cool. So what's going on up here? I don't really know. But yeah, what are your thoughts on the pea shooter in Battle for Neighborville? Do you think he's, you know, good, bad, or somewhere in between? I don't know if you hear all about it. So that's the bomb of granite payload. Oh, that actually got somebody, but then they got me. So they're pushing that, and they're gonna try to destroy Crazy Dave's uh, satellite, I think is the idea then. Let me try to change character again. I'm gonna keep doing it. <laughs> but yeah, I think pea shooter's great. I think that it'd be cool if he could get his hyperspeed ability again, but you know what? If not, it's all right. But in the meantime, I guess we'll play soldier. <laughs> I really want to play bee shooter, but we'll, we'll just take the chances when we can. So I really just also want to be able to play as much as possible. I'm still playing on launch day, and I'm probably gonna be doing that as much as I possibly can. Oh gosh, I missed all of that. I also would prefer the other soldier but uh, other soldier rocket jump that was available, but I don't know, maybe you can change those, maybe you can't, I didn't see an option. But I definitely will promote Pea Shooter at the end of today's episode, see if that gets us any extra coins. That should start us back at level one. Okay, he's skedaddling, I don't think we're gonna be able to get him. I did 15 damage to him though. Oh, you get back here. Oh, I gotta remember my super speed run. Yeah, what do you think you're doing? Get out of here. So what is all this stuff? Oh gosh, sunflower's coming for me. Ah, I gotta get out of here. Not what I wanted. So that's one thing, is that we can outrun enemies attacking us, because to fire, you can't be running in super speed. Oh, he turned into the ochre right at the last moment. That's not good. But you can move pretty quick with that. So basically, everybody has sort of some form of a hyper. That's pretty good. If you go around corners with that, you could probably stay away from enemies quite a lot. Dang. A lot of people are playing plants. I mean, it's always been the more popular team. It looks like somebody filled out that zombie slot, though. Okay, well, we're gonna keep moving down this way. So they're pushing that payload, we're trying to stop it. It ain't going so well. But this is a really cool map. Very cool looking for sure. I was still really impressed by how fast the uh, this next map loaded. Like, that's crazy. Oh, he's almost done, he's almost done. Ready to go, he's over here. Got him, ow. I don't even know what was hitting me there. It was hard to tell. Did that hit anybody? I don't know, oh, Colonel Corn. Got him, level two for, for a soldier, that's good. I will put something here. Remember that putting things now is free. So I gotta really put things down as often as I can. This Citron doesn't really quite see me, but man, does he have a lot of health. So jumping around, I can't really attack too much. Ooh, good try bonus at the least, right? Oh, a Hypno Shroom. So what's going on over this way? Ah, I'm getting in by the Hypno Shroom. Who would have guessed? Who would have guessed? I'm gonna keep moving. I do see this guy. I wanted to sneak up on him and try to take him down because I know he's low on health. Got him. That was good, that was good. Over this way. We got at least some people we can attack. Ow, ow, ow. This guy followed me. He followed me and he's gonna husk hop over me. Good, good strategy there. Okay. What's cool though is I've been seeing a lot of familiar names from uh, the PlayStation 4 Garden Warfare 2. Uh, there's people, you know, joining this one now, which is awesome. Team is still full. I'm sure it'll put me on plant team automatically next round anyways. But at this point, I've been playing more as, 
soldier than pea shooter. Luckily, most of you should know a good chunk about what pea shooter does if you've seen my Garden Warfare series. But if not, hopefully I'm able to provide some good tips, and I will continue to do that as soon as we can play as him again. Oh, that was good. Got a vanquish. What's going on over here? Somebody's firing at me. Where are you? I saw you jumping around that tree. Where are you trying? To, you trying to hide from me? Uh uh. Did that work? No. That really hurt. He had to be low on health though. I think he's already. No, no, he's still running around. Yikes. Okay. Okay. Well, somebody's surviving me. I might as well be nice. Even though it might not be the best idea, I'm gonna skedaddle a little bit because they just gotta get the payload right here. Like that's problematic. Why didn't my ZPG fire there? I thought I pressed the button. Maybe it did and I just didn't see it. I don't know. Ow, this hurts. I'm getting out of here. I'm trying to be careful wherever I can. Okay, there's the bomb granite again. I love how smug it looks. He's like, hey man, it's no big deal. Okay, who can I hit with this? Hopefully somebody good. Yeah, I hit nobody. Got a lot of weeds. Okay, definitely try to focus down the sunflower if I have the ability to. Oh, she's running though, she knows. Uh, let's quickly plant something, anything really. Healing actually sounds pretty good. Ah, hi, hi, I really need that healing. You have so much health, everybody has so much health. I feel like the, the soldier definitely doesn't hit as hard as he used to, but I don't wanna make too many comments on him because I'm gonna do my own episode on him as well. Oh boy, come on. Keep getting him, there it is, level three. Okay, buddy, get out of here. Oh, you jumped at the perfect time, you stinker. Come on, heal me, heal me, heal me. He's getting healed too. <laughs> Yikes, not good. Um, So I wanna go ahead and once again, try to change. Change character. Ah, oh well, that's fine. I, I'm starting to give up hope. Defend the batteries. So it looks like the plants have to go and do something with these batteries now. These are some really cool maps. Look at this giant spaceship. So yeah, that's the satellite, I guess. Yeah, Zasa instead of NASA. Just put his own name in it. So there's these different batteries we need to protect that they're going to try to beat up. Oh, they're everywhere. There are batteries everywhere. How does this work? We just have to defend all of these? That's gonna be tough. Oh, get rid of this guy. Come on, come on, come on. I almost got him. No, you get back here. I see ya. You're going down if I have the chance. No, I'm out like out of ammo. This did not turn out well at all. Just everybody else attacked me. Ah, oh, that stinks. It happens. It happens indeed. Okay, let's respawn. Oh, wait, no, wait, 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 hold on. I can at least play a little bit of speed shooter this round. Come on, come on, come on, quickly, quickly, quickly. I should have, the one time I don't try. The one time. Let's go. We're playing a speed shooter again. This is great. So yeah, definitely it seems like you need to change your strategy a little bit with the hyper because it's not hyper speed anymore. Oh, this is where we can spawn in plants. I haven't done this yet, so let me try this out. Uh, what are the, the healing? That sounds like fun. Um, but yeah, because you can't go hyper speed, I mean, everybody can run quickly is the thing now. So you really want to use it to get up high. I don't know who was attacking me. That was a little weird. Um, Oh gosh. Oh, is it like this? I feel like the satellite itself is attacking me. Okay. But of course we're waiting for all the zombies to bunch up and that's when we throw out the chili bean bomb. bomb. Especially if they don't expect it, that's always a great opportunity for us. But if I can get rid of the zombot real quick. There we go. A lot of these guys don't see me just yet and that's an excellent opportunity, like I said, to drop in one of these and then hopefully they won't see me for long enough that it'll explode and I'll get at least one vanquish. Beat up the scientist and I'm done. <laughs> but that could have gone even better. We got one vanquish out of it at the least, which is always good. Oh, and they're reviving him, of course. That makes sense. Wait, I didn't want to change my character. So we need to steal batteries. We just stole one of them. And we got to take them back here, I think is the idea. So these batteries don't count. These are just aesthetic. Only the batteries in the center, I think, count. Definitely get that guy a little bit, or that girl, sorry. Oh, there's a Captain Deadbeard uh, parrot. Pirate parrot. Okay, well, I can't get over that way, but I can at least run with my hyperspeed. Oh, hold L2 to hover. So that's a big difference. There was no hovering like that in the original. So I don't see anybody over there at the moment, so I think now's my time to just run and take it. Avoid everybody, I know they've seen me. I know they've seen me. How do I take it? Steel battery, that's mine. 
Thank you very much. The problem is I don't have my super speed. Oh no, when I, when I had the battery, I can't run super fast. Oh, somebody protect me, but I can attack them. I didn't get too far with it, unfortunately. But at least I can maybe get them bunched up in this little hallway. I can throw another uh, ch chili bean bomb at them. I don't know how long it lasts though. Let's respawn. Not very long, not long enough for me to actually do that. Um, it looks like there are two more batteries that people were trying to take. I would like to make the difference for those. Uh, Keep running. I love his super fast little feet though. <laughs> what is going on here? Oh gosh, I think the satellite, yeah, is attacking again. Yikes. Ow, stop that. <laughs> that is not good. It just keeps going for me. It's mad that I tried to steal the batteries. Gotta keep moving. Okay, so what's going on here? There's a space cadet going crazy over this way. Ow, what hit me? My gosh, it was a parrot. There's just too much going on right now. <laughs> it's really hard to keep up. Oh, look at poor pea shooter right there. Whoa, I can look all the way around now, that's cool. Before you can only really nudge. Can you respond me? Can you respond me? Uh, I don't know if he can. Ah, uh, darn, let's respond. Okay, two minutes left to steal five batteries is gonna be a bit of a challenge. But we can do it, can't we? I hope. Yeah, more of those satellite things are slamming down. Look at you go, the cactus looks like has some new, ow, moves. You are just so mean to me right now, aren't you? Okay, well, I'm just gonna continue to try to be sneaky. I was trying to get up there, you know. Ay, ay, ay. I don't see, ow, trash can bot attacking me. Okay, throw that down. Ow, Oh. None of that landed on you, unfortunately. <laughs> They're all chasing me right now. Whoa, the mech looks so cool. I love that. Can't wait to play as the imp. So that didn't turn out so well. I might wanna try to be a little bit more careful with things. But of course, you know, the pea shooter's primary attack with the, the pea, you gotta be careful with it because it can be difficult to land, but that's where it sort of uh, changes things up is it has splash damage. So if you aren't entirely you know, sure you're gonna be able to land hits. At the least, try to land a splash damage. Okay, dude, okay. There's too many, there's too many. I think I got one of them. If not, he's at like one health, which is a total shame. There's definitely a lot of zombies grouping up. I'm trying to keep up with my plant friends and seeing if I can't help them. Oh, this guy got it. We got this lady coming in. The cactus is just like extra tall and it's really throwing me off. Whoa, what are you doing? Were you running on the floor like a dog? That's weird. That's just plain weird, dude. Come on, come on. This guy doesn't see me, we need to focus on him. I can't even see what's happening right now, there's just too much. Jeez, they really know how to pack a punch. Those 80s action heroes, especially when there's like five of them. All right, well somebody tried to revive me there, it didn't go so well for them, unfortunately. And of course, it's gonna be like a bit of fluctuation as everybody figures out how in the world to play. I know that's for a fact. It looks like when I changed my team, it did clear my Vanquish count. That did not happen in the original Garden Warfare 2 or 1. Um, so that's something to keep in mind. Because I definitely had more than three Vanquishes. I've gotten three Vanquishes with the Pea Shooter, but I got a lot more with Soldier. So there's definitely a bit more of a, a problem with that. Come on, come on, can I get you, can I get you? I don't know, I gotta respawn, not respawn, reload. I'm not playing so well anymore. I played really well my first round. This is an awkward place to start it though. I want to start like a full round as pea shooter. That's what I want. Anyways, we're back at it. We gotta steal two more batteries. I see over there. I hope it's not gonna force me to play plant team or zombie team next round. Are you gonna hop out of that? I thought that we had him, but apparently not. Get him. That was a vanquish. Didn't give me the little ding, but that's okay. Oh, I see this guy. Oh gosh, oh gosh, throw this there. My aim was getting a little bit good there for a moment. And then it went bad again. Oh, I see you. I see you, get out of here. Yeah, my aim is going badly again. <laughs> Come on, that was just an assist, that was mostly me. Well, it seems like th some things never change. <laughs> oh, Super Brain's over this way, also an uncommon one. Oh, no you don't, no you don't. Leave those guys alone. You guys get back here. Stop, stop surviving everything. There we go. And then get you, quickly, quickly, quickly. We've stolen a good chunk of batteries, but we still need to steal more. Come on, guys, we can do it. This is mine. Wait, I need to press square to take it. Oh, darn, I, I thought I just had to run over it. That is tough. I don't think we're gonna take the win on this one, but it's very close. That was a lot of fun, though, for sure. I feel like turf takeover rounds are a little bit shorter here in 
Battle for Neighborville. But hey, that's fine. It was still a lot of fun. See ya, planet Earth. This satellite is going up there. Whoa. Whoa, look at this. That was, that's cool. So they, he just sent a, a lighthouse to the space. So our team lost, but that's okay. It happens. We'll live, we'll learn, and we're gonna move to the next round now. We'll do one more round for today's episode. Hopefully has more pea shooter action than anything else. And yeah, I didn't get top performer in any right, just because of the fact that I didn't uh, start on the, on the plant team, only at the very end. Oh, it looks like we're on Loggy Acres in Turf Takeover. This is another new map. I do not, come on, no! <laughs> please, please, I'm desperate. Yeah, there it is, all right. So it looks like uh, we're good. Game begins in 25 seconds. We're playing as the plants. I don't know if we're attacking or defending. I've done basically nothing but defending in today's episode. So, wow, Loggy Acres looks cool. Really cool. I like it so far. Let's, let's, I gotta remember to run. Which is an easy thing to forget, I suppose. Oh gosh, I don't know why I slowed down there for a moment. I guess the servers are a little laggy. Stop payload. So we're defending again. The zombies have a payload this time. Oh, it's a Z-Tech factory. Stop zombies from trashing our Malo Mor Mortar. Uh, oh gosh, hey, Captain Deadbeard. Haven't seen you too much this game. There we go. Got him vanquished. Would've been cool if that was first strike, but didn't, didn't look like it. I think first strike is still a thing. Trying to get this guy. I sort of got him. <laughs> Not entirely. He is like taking on that oak. Oh gosh, I'm in a bit of a trouble situation here. Back it up, back it up, back it up. Hey guys, don't just attack me, please. Uh, they are definitely trying to push this payload. Come on, one more hit on you, there it is. I'm getting healed up by something. I don't even know what's going on there. Oh gosh, no, 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 run, run, run. What is happening? I don't know, I don't know, run. Oh gosh, oh gosh. Oh no, Captain Deadbeard's coming for me, or somebody. I don't really know. Let's get set up. Soldier doesn't see me. Here's my chance. Captain Deadbeard's over here, got him. Get you too. Oh, he's all over the place. My aim is a little crazy right now. I definitely have to adjust to it. It is different than Garden Warfare in some ways. I'm getting up here. Oh, I see you with your super low health. Oh gosh, coming up close to personal. Got him, okay, Vanquish Cheek times four. This is great. Oh gosh, a little laggy still. Okay, well that was a little weird, but it worked. Oh, I saw you over there with like your five health. So not a good position to get you though. I can't even see anything right now. What is even happening? I definitely have to get used to what everything looks like and everybody's moves. Stop hitting me from the little corner. I see you over there. It's an 80s action hero again, as per usual. I just ran in, in a circle. But now I got a sunflower helping me out. Let's do this, so that hopefully that chili bean gets somebody. It got nobody. Keep getting him, keep getting him. Oh, come on. I know his shield is helping him a lot here, but it doesn't have to forever. There it is. Three more seconds on my chili bean until we can get that going on. Yeah, float over this way. Oh gosh, hey guys. I didn't realize there were some zombies up here. Oh. That really didn't do as much damage as I was hoping for. See ya, goodbye! <laughs> that was ridiculous. So I have some shield now. I don't know if that was from the sunflower. It might have been. Gotcha. You don't see me. But definitely landing uh, headshots on the zombies seems to make a big difference. There's another vanquish. We are earning them up right now. There's another one. Thank you very much. And that's a good thing to do with the Gatling pea shooter ability is just to hang back, try to be in a nice safe position, catch up the soldiers. Once you're done with all that, and finish him off. Okay, well, it looks like the soldier was hiding. He doesn't see my chili bean! That's what you wanna do. Sneak up on them when they least expect it, and some good stuff can happen. We are tearing it up this time, this is amazing. More zombies over this way? I don't really know what's going on at the moment. I guess they were right behind me the entire time. We're on an 11 vanquish streak right now. I mean, I know everybody's super new at the game, so that's probably giving me a little bit of an advantage. Seeing how we had over 400 episodes, on Garden Warfare 2. Could you really blame me? Driving maybe a little bit of advantage against newer players. I mean, I would hope I would. If not, I'd be a little embarrassed. 
There we go. Oh gosh. I mean, I know some of these people are also probably veterans of the Plants vs. Zombies shooter games, but I'm sure it's a mix of everything. That guy has an ice cream. Oh, so I remember now. There was one of those last episode. I was a little confused. You could buy one with tacos. I was like, what is it? I guess that's what it is. So we're doing a pretty good job at stopping the payload. I'm at 12 vanquishes right now. I had a 12 vanquish streak. That was all one life. I played a little bit risky towards the end there. Probably could have kept it going for longer if I played it safe. It's a long run back. I can tell you that much, but that's why we're defending and they're attacking. I love how fast you spin around. That's really cool. You're like a little top. Let's go over here. So they are slowly pushing forward, and that's something we will have to be careful of. Landing those shots can be really tough. Captain Deadbeard, nuh uh, not happening. Come on, I got, oh, the full vanquish there, nice. The oak is so loud when he stomps around that scared me. I was like, what is coming for us? I don't know. Luckily, it's not coming for us. Oh, I see this Captain Deadbeard, he's running away. Probably not the wisest, ow, ow, ow! There was somebody right behind me, of course. I didn't even see him, it was an imp. It looks like the soldier finished me off, but the imp definitely did the majority of the damage there. So that was not good. No, I wanna stay as P-Shooter. Actually, can I upgrade him now? I don't think I can, but I'll check. Upgrade. No, but I haven't showed these upgrades yet. This is something I applied in the first episode. We have combo, refreshing revive, rough patch, and low life, um, and also extra experience down this way. Um, basically, you have these different upgrades you can apply. I think they're pretty good how it's set up right now. We can always look into those and try to improve them later though. Uh, so yeah, we're, we're good. We just gotta keep going. I gotta earn vanquishes. I wanna stay at the top vanquisher even though we only have about a minute left. So we'll have to see how that ends up going. But at this point, I think I've gotten top vanquish streak uh, basically confirmed, but you never know. There's a lot of good players out there. Come on. <laughs> it's, a, it's a long walk. This game is so pretty though. There's like a lot going on visually. Okay, chili bean bomb, chili bean bomb. Do your thing. It's not gonna get him, unfortunately. But can I get him? Well, it looks like he's gonna hop out of his mech. I don't know, maybe that's just how the imp works now. That might have been changed, you know? Don't you dare hit me. Luckily, he didn't. I feel like there's a lot more wobble with the hyper than there used to be. Come on, come on, come on, get him. Almost got him. We gotta finish him off. There it is. Awesome stuff. I'm being attacked by something somewhere. Oh, no, you don't, no, you don't, no, you don't. I see you. You're trying to run from me, I think. Wait, was this another soldier? Yeah, I guess so. We gotta go back this way. Oh, and there it is, the game's over. Okay, so we were, they weren't able to push the payload to its end, unfortunately, but I'm sure we'll see more of this map in the future. That was a ton of fun. I really enjoy it so far. And uh, yeah, let's see. Plants won, we defended all four points. And yeah, that was great, we stopped the cart. Did we get top? Vanquish streak, maybe even top vanquisher, but I didn't do so well towards the end, I got distracted. Top vanquisher, but I guess there's no top vanquish streak anymore. Well, that's sort of a shame. Anyways, I'm happy with that. I'm pretty sure we got both. <laughs> but yeah, objective master, oh, it's so cool that they added that, I didn't realize that. They didn't have that going on for one or two, and I always wish that they did, is objective score. But yeah, I guess they have that now, and you can also get on the podium for it. Very cool, so we're gonna head back to Giddy Park and have some fun there, that'll be great. So there was our look at the pea shooter, lots of fun here, of course, just like any classic character from Garden Warfare, whoa, the game's really laggy right now. But yeah, we'll just take one last look at him, and I definitely wanna find a way to upgrade him, I think there's gonna be a way to do that. Um, I don't know if like, yeah, we don't have any customizations for him at this point, but I did wanna also check out his gestures, so haven't looked at those too much. We have the happy jump, and we'll unlock more of these as we go along. We also have the funny, it laughs, and then finally, the sadness. He cries. All right, well, let's go over, I think it's somewhere around here, right? I don't know why the game's so super laggy right now. Maybe just because of all the other people around. Ooh, over here maybe. Let's try this out then. I'm gonna oh, hop up this way. Promote characters. Yeah, here we go, Butanic. Botanic? Yeah, that's what it is, Botanic. Uh, come be the best plant you can be. Promotions await. So we got the pea shooter to level 10, which means we can now promote you. Got some experience XP under your belt, I see. Looks like someone's ready to be a better, stronger plant. Not bad, not bad. 
but you're no plant with plants on it, like me. <laughs> then again, no one is a plant as plant plant as me, as plant as me. Look at all my plants! <laughs> But you keep this up and you might get close. You got promise, single plant. All right, well th that guy just wanted to brag about himself. Promotions await. Promote characters that reach level 10. Every character can be promoted up to five times, just like in Garden Warfare 2. Promotions unlock new upgrades for that character. So that's awesome, ready for promotion. Press X to promote the character now from recruit to advanced um, homing P. Handling, P cannon P's home towards targeted enemies, that'd be fantastic, and also last ditch damage. Deal additional damage with last P and P cannon. Those also sound really good. So let's try that out. P shooter recruit, going to advanced. That's cool. So once again, we get the homing P, and we also get the other thing. We get the last ditch. Very cool stuff there, for sure, I'm happy about that. So we were able to showcase the pea shooter and get him the master. We'll try to do that with each variant, or not, each class, sorry, that we showcase, get them to level 10 for that episode. But we can also, with our many coins, almost 200,000 of them, buy one capsule for today's episode. I wanna probably, probably try to do like a million coin spending spree at some point, but right now, emotes, we get one, it's a common. That's a little bit of a shame that we only get one emote out of 30,000 coins. It looks like the, the, whoa, the monetization coin thing is a little bit different than it used to be. We'll have to wait and see if that changes. But yeah, that's gonna wrap it up for today's episode. Be sure to let me know your thoughts on the pea shooter and yeah, let me know what plant or zombie you want me to showcase next. But for right now, that is gonna wrap it up for today's episode of Plants vs. Zombies Battle for Neighborville. Before you go, be sure to comment pea shooter zebra so that you've watched the end that you are a zebra-tastic viewer. Also, subscribe to join the zebra herd. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.